Hey everybody, how you doing? This is about to be a really fun video. If you guys have been watching the channel, you would know that I have been getting into the PCP Boulot Slingers. If you're not familiar with what that is, it's these babies that use compressed air. These two tanks on this one on the bottom hold a whole bunch of compressed air. And when I'm talking about a whole bunch of compressed air, some of these hold 4,500 PSI. Here's another one right here. That was the 50 caliber Dragon Claw. This one right here, this is my 25 caliber Avenger. But you can't just go out to your garage and use your regular old air compressor. Like I said, some of these go up to 3,000 PSI, over 4,000 PSI. The biggest thing that I got from you guys was, yeah, those are all cool, but hey, the compressors are kind of expensive, which is true. Now you can hand pump these, but it's gonna take you like two hours, and who has time to sit there and do two or three hours of hand pumping, take, you know, flying 20 bullets and then go back to two more hours of hand pump. Nobody wants to do that. But I went out and I found the cheapest air compressor for these PCPs and it's less than half the cost of the one that I've been using. So that's what we're gonna do today. Portable PCP air compressor with built-in transformer. And from the Amazon link, it shows that this would be everything you need. You can hook it up to your wall, plug it into your wall. The Amazon page said you could hook it up to a car, 12 volt battery, charge these air babies anywhere you need to, I suppose. But that's what we're going to do. Take it out of the box. See how it runs. It says it has auto stop, which is cool. And it doesn't need any water or oil. So that's cool too. Less hassle. But this one is under 400 beans, um, which... Like I said, is the most affordable compressor I could find for these things. So I'm going to take it out to the kitchen where I got a table. I can lay stuff, see how it works, put it all together, and we'll see how the cheapest air compressor works out for us. Should be pretty cool. All right, so here we go. Just got this thing. Have not even taken it out of the box yet for this video. Take it out of the box, and then we got a couple of these babies we need to top off of there. See how it runs. So I'm gonna open up this box and then show you everything inside. Looks like it's packaged pretty well in that foam and everything. And it looks like we got a little bit of a parts kit here with the Hose attachment and a user manual. And a power adapter cord. And the compressor itself here. There you go, and it's even blue. So, I'm gonna take a quick look at the instruction manual, and then we'll be right back. So, just took it out of the box, looked at the instruction manual. It really is pretty much self-explanatory. So there's a storage space right here on the side for your 12 volt battery connectors. The air connector goes right there that you connect to your PCP boo line slinger. Got your power cord right here if you're plugging it into the wall, which is what we're gonna do today inside the house. On the top here, it has a pressure regulator so you adjust this to the pressure that you want to fill the tanks. It has a max pressure of 300 bar or 4,500 PSI. So I'm going to hook it up to this Avenger right here and set it for 3,000 PSI. And we're going to turn this baby on. It's got automatic shutoff. Should be pretty cool. Let's see what happens. I'll show you a little bit closer. This right here, you set to your max pressure of what you're wanting to do. So for this one, I'm gonna set it to 3000 PSI there. Air connectors there, power's there. 
this is where you would plug this plug if you're putting it on your car battery or 12 volt battery and then there's the on button and a thermometer there but yeah pretty easy pretty straightforward got it plugged in let's hook it up to this baby and turn it on all right i misspoke this avenger we can charge up to 4000 psi so i'm gonna go over here and set it for 4000 you can see there i've got this baby set right on 4000 so it should shut off when i plug it in the fan's gonna automatically turn on then i'm just gonna hit this compressor button and it should fill it up to that 4000 psi and shut itself off see what happens connect to the tank there on that baby when i plug it in the fan's going to start then i'm going to turn the compressor on you'll probably hear it chug 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 and it'll probably take a minute to top this thing off uh but here we go plugging it in so there's the automatic fan coming on now i'm going to turn the compressor on We're sitting on 3,000 right now, and I've got it set to automatic shutoff at 4,000. All right, so it just shut off. Let's check the gauge here. And it stopped right there at the 4,000 marks. But there you have it, guys. The price on this compressor is less than half of any other one that I've ever seen super simple operation literally plug it in connect the air hose set your air pressure and then it shuts off at the max that you set it at pretty pretty sweet but i am happy with it we're going to be doing more videos i'm going to test it out on my car see how that works while i'm out there at the range and need some air when i'm not at the house uh, that's super handy to have the ability to connect it to a car but that's the number one complaint that you guys have been getting me is the compressors are too high well this compressor is about the same price as this avenger right here so bing bang boom you could get set up for a lot more or less moolahs than you might think or that you'd seen before like i said i went on a mission to find the cheapest compressor to try to help more people get into this air stuff but hey tested it out quick today thing works good ship to me quick let me know what you think about it i'll put some links down below so you guys can go check this thing out for yourself also i'm gonna see if i can contact these people and get even more of a discount code uh, sometimes people are willing to uh, do that type of thing so look down below i'll have a link to this thing and if i can i'll get some discounts you guys can get, even take advantage more of that but Appreciate y'all watching. Stay tuned. Like I said, we're going to test this thing out uh, some more and some more videos in the future. Appreciate y'all. We'll see you on the next one.